if she is shaming descendants of this, will she continue to do that when she is now one of them? Well, now we understand why she always makes Whoopi get the coffee. What's up, YouTube? Hope you guys are feeling good. Today, guys, we're back with a new video. We're going to be checking out Craig Gottfried and he lets view host Sony. Okay, hosted. Let's check this out together, guys. It's going to be so awkward on you know new episodes of the view when she tries to pull the race card yes and then she's like america is racist and then they're like yeah they might be racist but they're not like slave owner racist <laughs> like like somebody that we that that's we, uh, so true yeah you know? oh i'm gonna milk this till the end of time that was greg gutfeld with his outstanding critique on fox news as he thoroughly dismantled sunny hostin live today we dissect the recent backlash against sunny hostin from the view who was stunned to discover her ancestors were slave traders on the show finding your roots okay so one might expect this revelation to be well perceived by someone known for spewing racist and vile views on daytime television however it appears to have really deeply unsettled her according to people magazine sunny's mother was was so upset at this revelation that she cried after learning about their family's slave owning past, expressing deep disappointment. But the truth is, it seems like she's more concerned about how this could affect her daughter's career as a professional okay. educator. <laughs> so let's all share a hearty chuckle at her expense. If she is shaming descendants of this, will she continue to do that when she is now one of them? Well, now we understand why she always makes Whoopi get the coffee. <laughs> oh my goodness. Now, some may find this criticism towards Sunny Hostin harsh, but it's important to consider her past statements. Hostin has often labeled white conservatives as hmm. racist and criticized Elon Musk's purchase of Twitter, suggesting that it empowered mainly straight white men. Her apparent disdain for white people, particularly white women, is evident in her reactions to fans contacting her about her ancestors' history. This context sheds light on the response to Hostin's discovery and invites reflection on her own attitude towards race and identity. So y'all can stop texting me and emailing me and saying that I'm a white girl and that I don't deserve reparations. That's, I still believe oh, that- Someone did this, that to you? Yes. I don't know who sent her a thing telling her she was a white girl. Okay, it's, it's, it's too much, people. Notice how repulsed they seem to be by the suggestion that Sunny Houston mm. is a white woman. What is the problem with Thank being you. a white woman? She acts as if it's the ultimate insult, despite that demographic being the show's primary audience. Houston herself has compared white women to cockroaches and implied that they blindly support the patriarchy through their voting behavior. This irony highlights a disconnect between the show's content and its viewership, raising questions about the dynamics at play within the program and its portrayal of certain demographics. I read a, a poll. Do you guys saw her hand like how it was going like? Don't call me a white woman. Like, I see if there's something bad being a white woman. Like, I don't know why. These are the people who are racist. She's herself, she's racist. Sonny Hostel, she's a racist. She just don't want to accept it. Well, just yesterday, that white Republican suburban women are now going to vote Republican. Why? It's almost like roaches voting for raid, right? It's, it's I, I like think that's they're that's voting, no, it's insulting they're voting to the against, voter. We, they're we, voting no, against no, no. their own self-interest. Do they want to live in Gilead? Born out when you look at the studies and when you when you read books like uh, it's a book that came out a long time ago about she owned owned property as well, meaning white women own slaves as well. Um, I, I think that women, white women in particular, want to protect this patriarchy here because it's to their benefit. Listen to what she said. She just cited a poll stating that white Republican suburban women are voting Republican. Wait, what? What do you expect them to vote for, Thank Sunny? You. Democrat? This woman is a lawyer, so I guess that pretty much summarizes the state of the justice system. She appears to possess the intelligence of a raisin. She's so fixated on race and narcissism. Besides her derogatory remarks about whites, she's labeled blacks and Latino conservatives as oxymorons. She's very disrespectful to her co-host and guest. Frankly, I think the left are even getting tired of her, so don't feel too bad about a few jokes at her expense. Here's Jamachi to lighten the mood. In, in her defense, mm -hmm. everyone has ancestors that did unspeakably horrible things. It's just that 
not everyone's ancestors have records tied to their their DNA about it. But I'm more worried for Sonny Hostin's progeny in the future that do a DNA test and find out that they were related to a cast member of The View. <laughs> <laughs> and they're like, oh, it all makes so much sense now. Why I'm so stupid and fat. <laughs> While we do enjoy some humor on the show, let's ponder for a minute. Are people being overly harsh on Sunny? Can she bounce back from being perceived as a, <laughs> as a white woman? Or is her time on The View coming to an end? Okay, um, this is a turn interest in watching. Uh, Sonny Holston, her attitude, she's very disrespectful, like 100%. Everyone knows that she's very disrespectful to our host, also to our guest. Uh, I don't know why she perceived white as. Nah, you don't address me as a white woman. I see being a white is disgusting. Like, I don't know why some, not just Sonny Hustle like that, some black people act that way. As if whites, being white is a bad thing. Like, why? You, you yourself, you are a racist if you act like that. You are actually a racist. Some black don't see themselves as racist, but you are a racist. Sonny Hustle, she's a racist. But she just won't talk about racism and being a narcissist. So this is very serious. Um, I love the last video right there, the sense of humor. I love how it is funny. <laughs> I try I laughed. This was interesting to watch, and I don't. I, I try to watch the view. I just see about them, and so maybe see some clips on Twitter. That is basically it. But uh, I feel like people should stop giving that, giving them attention. I feel like. I love them that all Democrats are uh, they're all playing politics games and stuff like that. <sighs> so guys comment down below what you think about our video. Give us a thumbs up, share this video to as many as you can, subscribe to our channel. I will see you guys in the next video. Make sure you stay safe. I just want a bag like an old lady. I'm back wood smoking. I don't own papers, pass that 808. That don't don't shake her. Oh bitch, you know I'm grinding like a pro skater. Baby mama bugging. I'm so quick to hit ignore. Buku bitch, in my bed. I got scales all